Hello everyone, today I'm here to unbox Alcree. If you don't know Alcree, Alcree is a monthly YA book box that comes every month and it comes with a newly released YA book, as well as three to five bookish items coinciding with the theme. There's a theme each month. I just do want to apologize for the lighting. It snowed last night and by snow I mean a dusting and whenever it snows in my southern state the whole city just shuts down and with that, you know, the snow reflecting, lots of light, sun's going in and out, so I apologize for the lighting. Um, anyway, you have a code if you want to check out Alcrate. You can use the code Bookables to get 10% off. I do not get any commission from it. In exchange, I get a free box each month just to be fully transparent. Um, so yeah, let's open this up. Um, I don't know the theme this month. Do I ever? It sounds very jangly. I don't know. Is that the right word? So the card this month is a beautiful woman. She's got like a heart and there's like a moon. It's called a power within. So I'll pop that right there so I can reference to it. Um, what am I saying? Oh, I'm seeing a lot of things. So I'm just going to go for this. This looks like a deck of cards. Um, I've gotten so many deck of cards in both boxes. And I'm just not, I don't want to say gamer. I'm just not a card person. So I, I don't know what I'll do with these. <laughs> if anything, I don't know what is inspired them. Rattle the stars to whatever end. This might be a Court of Thorns and Roses. I'm not sure. They are very pretty though, I will say that. Like, look at that. They're like kind of steel blue. It's pretty plain cards. I'll give you that. Who is this? I am not sure. Oh, Throne of Glass. Okay. Yes. I figured it was. I knew it was got had to be something. So there's a whole bunch of Throne of Glass characters on it. Oh, which way am I doing? Let's see if I can find one. I can't tell, honestly, who they are. That looks like Manon. I know that one. Um, that looks like Selena. Could you be Kale? I'm not sure. Or could you be um, Rowan? I don't know who you are. <laughs> it's been such a while. That's got to be... Um, I can't even remember the characters' names. What's wrong with me? Oh, that's Kale. That's my boy. Um, anyway, they are very, very, very pretty. Like, I can't get over how shiny they are. So, I don't love playing cards, but, like, the, the like, ends are beautiful. Is that a thing? I don't know. I have this little thing. I don't know what that is. Okay, it looks like a bookmark that's also kind of a ruler, and this is from Hey Atlas Creative. Um, okay, this is inspired by the Witchland series. I have read the first book. Um, oh, and you get two of them. Cool. So I might, like, put one of these in a giveaway. I'm pretty sure this is, like, a ruler. Yeah, it's a ruler, so that's cool. I do. Do I use ruler a lot? Not really. <laughs> yeah, you get two middle, uh, metal bookmark rulers um, inspired by the Witchland series. So it, they're cool bookmarks, and I'm not going to lie, you could put a tassel on them, too. So I, I never get mad about getting bookmarks and book boxes no matter how many I get because I go through them a lot <laughs> then we have something in this little cute pouch that has moons and stars on it it's like oh it's like a little cleaning cloth I'm gonna guess and it says a witch is just a girl who has realized her power for her own oh and there you go what is this from I'm not sure am I ever this is from oh wicked saints it's actually that's a book i really do enjoy so this is really cool and i need one of these actually for my camera for my glasses for my phone so this is actually going to come in handy so i'm probably going to put this in my shoot set <laughs> my camera bag and it's just a nice cleaning cloth i'm a photographer i don't have cleaning cloths am i professional no. <laughs> then we have this big old thing which i'm guessing is like a bento box um and in the front you get a nice little spoon and chopsticks which I am so ill versed at but it's great to have them um so that's awesome and it's like this really pretty like mint green color you open it up and there you have it so that's really cool I actually can use this for myself for like leftovers I could see taking this like if um Noah's gonna go to my mom's or his grandparents for a while I can just pack you know some strawberries a sandwich like this is perfect um so yeah I this I mean I could see everybody using this and needing this and I love that it has a compartment for utensils right here so that way you don't have to lose them so this is really nice I like it a lot honestly it's probably my favorite thing and I've never seen like a bento box in a book box ever inspired by Mistborn readers who enjoy tastier foods oh okay they use sandrial steel alphabet to spell alcrate on the top so there you have it so this is really cool i like this a lot so this is awesome very unique 
And then we have a little keychain as well, which I have so many keychains, so I'll probably do a giveaway for this one or put it in a giveaway. It says Break Bills Alumni. I don't I don't know what this is from. It's got like a B on it with a key. Oh, I'm a horrible fandom. Oh, this is the Magicians. Um, and then lastly, you're getting a little enamel pin that comes in every month. And this month, we have one that's got a really pretty crown on it. It says, Still, I Will Fight. I like this one a lot. And I believe that's all you're getting as far as the goodies. You do get a little um, exclusive of Chain of Gold by Cassandra Clare, which I, if you don't know, I've... I'm kind of done with the whole Shadow Hunters world. Not that I don't like it anymore. I'm just, I feel like I'm just kind of, I don't know. I just don't have a ton of interest, as sad as that is. So I'll throw this in a giveaway as well. And so the book this month, I have no clue, honestly. All the Stars and Teeth by Adeline Grace. Never heard of it. And this is our great exclusive cover, and it is signed. I should mention they always come signed. Um, so the cover of this, I will say, is stunning. It's got like a boat and a skull and it looks like it's gonna be piratey maybe? I don't know. Let's figure it out. Let's see if anything's- oh that's really pretty right there. She will reign as princess of the island kingdom. Amora has spent her life training to be high and a- and romance? I don't know. The master of souls. The rest of the realm can choose their magic, but for Amora, it's never been a choice. To secure her place as heir to the throne, she must prove her mastery as the monarchy's dangerous soul and magic. But when her demonstration goes awry, Amora is forced to flee. She strikes a deal with Bastien, 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 a mysterious pirate. He'll help prove that she's fit to rule, and she'll help him reclaim his stolen magic. That's interesting. I do really like pirate books. I don't read near enough of them, but I do enjoy them. So, Princess, pirate, stowaway, mermaid, the crew makes the queen. This sounds interesting. I've never heard anything about it, so I'm gonna have to check it out. Oh, I love when books have maps in them. They just are cool. And this one is signed, I believe. Where is signed at? I thought it was signed. Oh, it is signed. So you're also getting this little letter from the author that has the saying on it as well. And then you're getting the booklet that they have each month. So let's see what the original cover looks like. Okay, so it doesn't look much different. The original cover is kind of like a darker blue and the Alcrate one is more tealish, I would say. So both are beautiful. I like teal more, so I'm probably gonna go with that one. Um, and this just tells you everything that's in the box. I always look at what is like kind of similar to the book that came in the box. If you like these, if you like the book that's in this current box, then try these. Um, the Merciful Crow, haven't read it. Kingdom of Souls, haven't read it. The Song of the Current, I have read that. It was okay. So I don't know if I'll like this one or not. I don't know. But either way, that's really cool. And next month's theme is Music of the Night. Ooh. Oh, I bet I can guess what's in this box. What book is gonna be. And you're gonna get an item from Flick the Wick. Yes, I love Flick the Wick. I love their candles. Um, I use them all the time for my bookish photos. So yeah, that's everything you're getting in the box. I'm gonna show you everything that you're getting, like I just said. So I definitely say my favorite thing is the Bento box because I find this the most um, useful. Like I, I'm, I'm gonna get a lot of use out of it. So let me just say that. Like this is great. Um, it's my favorite thing. And it's just so unique and I love the color. Um, I also, surprisingly, I don't think a lot of people are going to be stoked about this cleaning cloth, but I am because I'm in dire need of one, so I'm really excited about it. Um, and then you're getting these playing cards, which I'm not super thrilled about. I have like five sets of playing cards, like bookish playing cards, which are great, but I just don't have a lot of practical use for them. I do really enjoy these bookmarks. I use bookmarks a ton, so I'm happy to have two of them, so that's good. Um, and then we have a keychain, which I like, but I have a ton of keychains on my key ring, so I probably won't put it on there. I'll probably put this in my giveaway bag where I like pull from every time I, I need to do a giveaway soon probably. But anyway, that's everything you're getting in the box. Overall, I thought it was a pretty good box. It's not one of my favorites. I think because um, Alcrate's been doing a lot of Y fantasy, which they do a lot, and I've been falling out of that genre a lot. Like I haven't read a single fantasy book this year, I don't think. Who? <laughs> Um, that's a lot to say for me. Um, so I feel like I'm just, I don't know, I feel like I'm kind of like drifting from Y Fantasy, which makes me, I don't think, connect with Outgrade Boxes as much because they use a lot of Y Fantasy, understandable, because a lot of people read it. I'm just, I don't know, I need to get back into it. I just haven't had a book yet that has been really wowed me or I've really wanted to read that's been a Y Fantasy. So that happens. I'm just in that season of life with reading now. It happens to everybody. But either way, I would love to know what your favorite item in this box was. Mom is 
definitely the bento box. I don't think I want to be alone in that. But yeah, I'd love to hear your thoughts. And like I said, I'll leave all of Alcrate's links down below for you to check out. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.